A local animal rescue reports an alarming spike in animal abuse cases in South Florida. The owner of iHeart Animal Rescue tells us over the last month, multiple dogs have come to their shelter starving and on the verge of death. CBS News Miami's Anna McAllister spoke to her about this ongoing crisis. She's also sharing what you can do to help these animals. He did. <gasps> This is Mitch, and at only a year old, he's just skin and bones after he was found abandoned and starving. Tied up at a park, emaciated to the max. Really horrendous. But Mitch isn't the only one. Cindy Machaccio, who runs iHeart Animal Rescue, a nonprofit focused on helping abused and abandoned animals recover and find forever homes, says over the last few weeks she's seen an influx of starvation cases like Mitch's. If you want a dog just to put in your backyard and tie up, then don't even have a dog. Like Mitch, Bentley, an eight-week-old puppy, was also brought to iHeart Animal Rescue, malnourished and in need of medical treatment. Like one pound that should be about six pounds at this at this age. On top of the abuse cases, iHeart Animal Rescue is also helping neurologically disabled dogs who are products of inbreeding. The rescue helps to pay for the treatment all of these animals need, but as they continue to care for more animals, they desperately need the public's help. If you can help our rescues to foster or to donate, that will help us to continue to keep taking dogs. Reporting in Davie, Anna McAllister, CBS News, Miami.